Hey, what's up, you guys? Craft Farms here. Welcome back to Tahitian County. Well, as you can see, we are in January, January 1st. So that means we got uh, some grain to be sold. We got oats, sorghum, and corn to be sold. Um, if we take a look here, at our cows, um, we have seven of them at a 30% reproduction rate. The other 20, or the other 16, are at 20%. Uh, we got 100% pro productivity going. Uh, we're still good on straw. For some reason, we're making milk, which doesn't make sense, being uh, these are Angus cows, but uh, that works. Um, we're good on hay and grain yet, and, uh, we have quite a bit of feed still. I did have to, uh, feed, but we're going to go ahead. Uh, it is currently snowing. Um, <clears throat> we are going to fire up the truck. I got the auger set up already on our corn bin. So, we're going to go ahead, we're going to go over and uh, load up with some corn. Um, I did take care of our fields off camera, um, the removing of waterways and that sort of thing. So... Tarp opened up. And we'll get ourselves lined up here. Um, okay. I don't know why that happened. Start this tractor up here. Uh, we're going to disconnect it. Yeah, I don't get why the world. This thing bounced around like that. I mean, the truck wasn't even near it. Try that. We'll see if we can get pulled under here. There we go. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Let's get this hooked back up now. Okay. Hmm. Oh, too far away. Okay. Can I push this back? There we go. 
Okay. It's not perfect, but it'll work. So we'll get loaded up here. So, um, I'll show you guys here. So, I have all the waterways in field 142 taken out. I took them out on 143. We combined 128 and 127 together. And then I was going to combine 158 and 159 until I got over there and realized this is the railroad bed. So, that's going to be a no-go there. Okay, so we have 1,095 on, so we'll have one load and a partial. FS grow mark. And of course, it wouldn't be the one that's right by us. It's the one all the way over there in town. Okay, well, let's get on the road. Oh, we better shut our tractor off. So it's not running while we're gone. Okay. All right, now we can get on the road. So this is kind of a fitting video where we're in the snow, you know, it's currently snowing, and uh, <clears throat> it, this is actually uh, going up on Christmas, I believe. So I hope everybody has a great Christmas. and. Uh, hope it is full of lots of fun, laughs, good uh, food, and spending time with uh, family and friends. So I'm not too sure of just how much we'll get hauled out today. Um, but I will probably finish hauling off camera just because it's kind of going to be nothing but the same thing. Load, drive, unload, repeat. So, this trailer needs some lights down the side. Pretty bland going down the road, especially behind this truck. But, oh well. Farm looks pretty good off in the distance there. Hopefully, by this time next year, we'll uh, have some decent changes on the farm. Um, get some more buildings, stuff like that. Yeah. <clears throat> 
So once our January trucking is done, uh, we're going to be sitting down and uh, get this year's crop plan put together uh, with the new fields included. So for this year, we're going to keep our alfalfa field that we have, and then we're going to uh, plant one more in, uh, I think it was field 129, uh, right there by the farm. Or, well, right, right where uh, our current alfalfa field is, our old sorghum field from last year. And then... Uh, once we do expand the farm, we're going to expand outwards into where our alfalfa field is currently at. So uh, when we do that, then we're going to plant that uh, field 138 into alfalfa. So for the time being, our current alfalfa field gets to stay. Definitely tell the old girl is loaded down. Too busy looking at that farmyard back there. Hey now, don't be honking at me. Not my fault you're too close. So I see our big old beacon over there. Shooting to the moon. Insight right there. To Heaton Senior High. I actually haven't really looked around the town on this map much. Uh, I think I've only gone into it once, and that was to get that load of seed that we picked up last um, last spring over in that building there. Hoppers, perfect. All right, time to make some money. Let's see what we get. Hopefully, we get a good chunk of change because we definitely need the money. There's fifteen thousand twenty twenty five thirty. 35, thousand two hundred and thirteen dollars plus a two thousand dollar environmental bonus. So not 
too bad, actually. Let's go straight and go to the main road. too sure here. What is the elevator that is right up here? GW Grain and GW Grains. So our oats will go there. Tahitan Farmer's Market. Where is that one at? show up. So let's see if we can figure it out. Ethanol, poet commodities. that elevator at then. Hmm. That one's not actually here, is it? So... Mm -hmm. Alright, here. Tahitan Farmer's Market. Let's run over here and look at this once. Figure this out. So it's this point right over here. Oh, right here. To eat in farmer's market. Wow. Alright, that's quite the uh, spot. Okay. Well, now we know where that's at. So, our corn, and then what else had to come here? So our corn and our, then when we go to sell soybeans, that'll come here. Okay, so then our sorghum also has to come, and that has to go to that farmer's market. Okay, good to know. difficult to see inside of this truck. Let's get this course play deal out of here. There we go. That's better. I'll make for cleaner screenshots. Yeah, I should have taken the. I should have not put this visor on this truck. I can't uh, see out of it. All right, let's go back and reload. Definitely a lot more uh, get up and go with this truck now. 
That is for sure. I don't know why, but I really like this little yard right here. It's nice, small, simple. Some big bins, though. Nice, nice bin setup. And it's got a little pasture. If only there was a cut across road that went up to the straight to the farm. And the Jake brake sound on this truck reminds me of the truck I normally drive at work. Just bellers. It's the only one of our four trucks too that bellers that loud our other three are well the other older Volvo like that one is uh, fairly quiet uh, the International is decently quiet too and then the boss's new Volvo that he bought that one you don't even hear but that's a much newer truck. Got emissions stuff and all that fun garbage on it. turn. Get our tarp opened up. Alright. Fire up this tractor. get another load. I think I can actually see it loading. That's the neat thing about the uh, windows. The only downside of this trailer is that it's not individual hoppers like most are. Alright, 
load it up and we're ready to rock. And we'll head on back. Definitely excited to use some of our new equipment this spring and coming up this fall as well with our uh, combine and um, we'll have our we'll have a hired man for busy seasons. So that'll uh, that'll really help out. Can have him combining, or can have him uh, running oh boy, running grain cart and trucks. That's not good. The truck is not a fan of snow. That is. For sure. So we'll get this one into the elevator yet, and then uh, call it a day for the video, anyways. Definitely don't want to do this. This other one I'll do. This one's a lot wider. A little easier to take this corner. Be it would help too if the mirrors worked in this truck. Then I could actually see where. No animation with it. No animations in this truck whatsoever. Which is fine. That yard there isn't too bad either. That's a uh, hog farm. You can see the hog buildings off in the distance there. It's right by our two of our new fields.
I am definitely glad though that this map actually has snow off of the main roads. I've played some maps before where it is not. So either you have to m move all the snow yourself or uh, you're gonna have fun driving around on it. And that that's never fun. Let's see, uh, county and city problem, not an us problem. Definitely looks nice going down the road though. Be better, like I said, if we had a trailer with a lot more lights. Because we have a whole lot of lights on the truck. load sold. I'll have to go back for a little load. Alright, so let's see what we get here. That was 35191 and another $2,000 environmental bonus. So we are just a hair over $200,000 now. So, that's going to do it today, folks. I am going to finish selling the uh, corn, that last little bit, and then I'm going to get the oats and sorghum sold as well and then when we come back we'll be probably feeding cows um, or else we'll be what is it that sells in March our sunflowers or we'll be selling sunflowers so thanks everybody for watching hope you enjoyed the video if you did be sure to hit that thumbs up button if you're new to the channel welcome hit that subscribe button if you like what you see if you have not done so already, be sure to turn on the post notifications to be notified every time I upload a new video. And as always, folks, we'll catch you all in the next one.